Hey, how's it going, Sherry? How's it going, Katrina? My name is Douglas James. I appreciate the time that you're taking to watch this video that I made for you. Um, in this video analysis, I'm going to show you exactly where you guys' business is online, your dental business. I'm going to show you how much uh, business that is generating you, how much it could be if you were at the top of the Google searches, um, and then show you the exact process, okay? Uh, so as you can see, we're on my business page, uh, Companies AMP Local or Internet Marketing Agency. Please visit us for more information. So um, I got connected with you guys because of uh, my partner. Brandon asked me to partner with him, um, and he's actually one of your patients right now. And he said that you guys have shown a lot of interest in uh, reaching more dental patients um, in your area. So we wanted to do this video for you to show you exactly where you guys are at. So um, I'm going to jump right into the video. So as you guys can see, we're on your site, right? So what I'm going to be going over you essentially is called search engine optimization, all right? So we're going to be optimizing your website for Google searches. So when someone searches um, for dental clinics or dentist in Saskatoon, uh, Canada, they find you versus your top competitor, okay? So right now... Um, I'm just going to kind of show you some of the stats in your city right now, Saskatoon. Um, someone needs dental work or a dentist, you know, around 2,500 up to over 3,000 times per month. So year round, there's a ton of leads to be made um, in your local area. So as you can see, Google tells us exactly what people are searching to rank your business for. So you want to be ranked in all of these keywords, right? So the most profitable keyword, of course, is the keyword dentist. So I'm going to be focusing on that search for you guys in this video. So Saskatoon Dentist. Um, so as you may know, this is your Google Maps. This takes up about 30% of, of all the clicks, and then the organics take up the remaining 70. Okay, so for Saskatoon Dentist, um, you guys are actually, I have it pulled up here, same search, page 4, and you are ranked um, right here at number 41 okay Viva Dental Studio okay so you guys are really far back in, in the search I also did dental clinic look that up you're on page 3 okay and you're down here let's see right here okay so 41 2 3 so 43 so you're on page 4 for most of the local searches alright so you guys really aren't getting um, too much attention to the website. So let me show you this chart. As you can see, the number one ranked person gets around 35% of, of the total clicks. Um, and 10 is where page one stops. And so that's about 3% of the total clicks. And as you can see, where we start page two, you know, there's almost no business there. You know, there's there's kind of a joke going around, you know, if you want to hide a body, hide it on page two of Google. <laughs> so there's a reason why that exists. So you guys are pretty much on page four, not getting um, any uh, you know new uh, dental patients from from your website so I want to show you the process and what's wrong in the errors with your site and how to fix them all right so Google has what's called an algorithm it has 200 determined factors but I'm going to talk to you about four of the most important ones the first one is the website so um, you know 80% of your clients are going to be looking at your um, your website through a phone, an iPhone or Android, so your phone, your website has to be mobile friendly. Um, so I'm just letting you know your site is mobile friendly. We did run through the test, it passed. I just want you to know that because that's the very first thing that we look at. Um, so your site is up to date as far as that goes. Um, the next thing is authoritative content and keyword research. So when someone hits your site, Google wants to know are you, are you educating them and are you mentioning all your services on your home page? All right, you want to have at least 1,500 words on the home page, and if you're going to be ranking for all these keywords like dentist, teeth whitening, root canal, dentures, um, braces, you know, dentist near me, all of these keywords, you want to have them mentioned on the home page if you expect to rank in it. So right now you only have maybe, you know, maybe 100 to 200 words, if that, right about here, just a small description of your business. All right. So you want to have at least 1,500. Let me show you what authoritative content looks like. So I typed an elephant on Google. Um, Wikipedia is notorious for these searches because being number one because of their authoritative content. So when I look at this page, 
there's endless information about elephants, their evolution, where they came from, their habitat, everything. All right, so this is what I'm talking about. You want to have like a nice large chunk of information, something like that, you know, 1500 words, you know, just on the home page, you know, because Google reads text, you know. Also, your pictures, you know, you could have pictures of uh, zebras and, uh, you know, I mean, fish, any, anything. And as long as you name the pictures something relevant to dentist in, in your city or, or dental uh, clinic in your city, uh, it's not going to matter because Google only cares about text. All right, so you want to make sure everything's optimized correctly. So that's one thing that we definitely have to look at. Um, just a side note real quick, something else that's very important is your page title, page description. Okay, that's this is your page title, this is your page description. So you want to have, if you're going to rank for dentist um, in Saskatoon, you want to say dentist, Saskatoon dentist. You know, dentist near me, Saskatoon, is um, it's kind of trying too hard. You know, so you, you want to definitely have branding is great, but you really want to just leave this for keyword research and your business. So um, and then you can have up to about 80 characters here. You want to use all those characters in your page description. OK, so we want to make sure we use all of your all those primary keywords there. All right. So that's another that's kind of like the on page optimization stuff. So. After we get your site optimized and it's got keywords, the page title descriptions optimized, all your pictures are named appropriately, we have 1,500 words on the home page. Um, the next thing we want to look at is your local citations. Now, some examples are Google, Yahoo, Facebook being yellow pages, white pages. Um, these are very important. This is how we get our business listed on the internet, right? When we do them, the business name, address, and phone number have to be identical, and you want to be listed in all of them. Right now, you have an 86% error rate, so that means only 14% are filled correctly. As you can see, you have a variation on your Facebook page, incorrect, um, incorrect name, variations of the phone number, and then you're just missing a lot of listings. This is the top 50 in the country. You definitely want to be listed in all of these. Okay. Um, so that's going to be the, that this is what's going to get you ranked number one in the Google Maps okay these local citations so once also your Google my business page has to be optimized correctly so we'll need your Gmail access to get into that um, there's a spot in there where you fill out you know 500 words of, of your introduction so that needs to be optimized with keyword research and everything you want to fill out your hours your location include at least 30 photos named correctly all right, so all that's very, very important. All right, so the last thing I'm going to talk to you about is um, backlinks. Okay, we also call these influence pages. So say you have a client that's thoroughly impressed with your service, right? They got braces or they they had their teeth cleaned. Maybe they write an article, which I'm sure happens all the time. Maybe they write, write an article or a blog. What's going to happen is they're going to mention you on the Internet. So anyone reading that article is going to click a link going to your site. This is going to give you a vote and according to Google. Right? So Google really is, SEO is all about what you say about your business online, what everybody else says about your business online. So Google wants to know, are these, how many links are linking to you and are they popular or not? So pretty much is you know Warren Buffett or you know Bill Gates mention you online or is it just an average blue collar worker right so it's a big difference between the two it's popularity it is a popularity contest um, so right now it's saying there's only one website mentioning you and the trust flow is zero so that means there's no power whatsoever so let me show you this so at a zero obviously you know you're very low quality anything over 20 is considered very high quality this these backlinks is is what's going to get you ranked number one on Google and is going to pull that percentage of business that your competitors are getting. You know, the controlling 35% on every single page is huge and it's going to bring a lot more patience to your chairs. So that's what we want to do is, is add the patience to your chairs and get you high on the Google rankings, right? So just to give you an example, I'll even show you, um, you know, a, a few of our clients. Um, I actually have a, a dental client myself. Um, I didn't. I didn't have him pulled up. I'll pull him up real quick. Yep, San Diego Orthodontist.com. Robert Sunstein. He's in San Diego, California. So let me show you the power of his site. 
when we first started, he was in a similar situation like you. Now he's on page one of Google. And as you can see, his site, we have 18, you know, websites mentioning him, and the trust flow is 30. Okay, so that's very powerful. It's actually off the charts. So all of our links that we can provide you are actually over 25 and 30. So they're super high quality sites, very popular, powerful sites. I'm going to show that, you know, that you are, you know, something going on. Google's going to want to give you higher, um, higher rankings. So, um, so this is the type of quality you can expect from us for sure. So um, that pretty much concludes the SEO analysis. I hope that made sense for you. You know, definitely getting you, you know, from page four, you know, for these major keywords, dentist and uh, dental clinic is going to get you a lot more business compared to where you are now. All right. So um, one thing Brandon is doing also that he wants to add in, in, into the program for you is he's actually doing lead generation websites. Um, so this is something that we specialize in. Uh, we launch, um, you know, websites specifically optimized out to one city. Um, and it's, you know, most of them could be simple one page websites where we're going to add more pages for more detail, but they're made for conversions. You know, as you can see, the phone numbers are all clickable. There's a spot, you know, to put your information right away. You know, always clickable, you know, click the call. Um, so we, so he built out this site and it's going to be generating leads and surpass your site as well, maybe in some keywords. So this is something that just another fish in the, uh, in the in the line in the water you know if you're going fishing if you if you have one pole or if you have ten poles you know you're gonna increase your chances of of getting more more dental patients so so that's what he's gonna be doing for you as well and he's gonna add that into the program so um, I appreciate the time you took to watch this video you know you have um, my contact information um, please reach out to Brandon um, he's going to have his contact information with this video. So uh, let us know what you like to do. And I really hope this made sense for your business. We we're really interested in locking elbows with you and bringing more dental patients uh, to your uh, studio there in, um, uh, in your area. So again, thank you so much for your time. My name is Douglas James and you have a great day.